have mulberry that is just through the roof. So if that's one of the allergens for you, you're yeah. going to be sneezing, coughing, however that impacts you. We also have juniper ash pretty high and staying mm -hmm. high today and tomorrow. But we will Bust get a out system. the allergy medicine. That's yeah. right. But we will have a system this weekend that will try and drop those levels a, okay. li a little bit for us. Yeah. So there is some relief there. But as we go outside, here's a look. We are warmer than we were yesterday in almost all locations. Uh, Alamogordo and Farmington, just a couple of degrees more mild than we were yesterday. But here's a look at those current temperatures as you head out the door. Light jacket probably will do for you this morning, except as we get you up into Durango, Alamosa, we do have some of the 20s and the 30s. You may want to have your jacket there. But overall, not a bad start to your Thursday. Dry skies. And early this Thursday morning, we do just have a few clouds moving overhead statewide for us. And the winds are starting to become a little bit stronger in a few locations. Mainly our eastern plains will have some breezy conditions today, but everybody fair game for a west wind 10 to 20 miles an hour. And with that paired with the dryer that we have and the heat, we are going to keep that high fire threat in place. I'll show you where we have those warnings. But also today we're going to be starting to see some 90s. The first 90s we have seen this year and a couple weeks early. We're actually about one to two weeks early on that. But here's a look at those red flag warnings. Really, the central mountains all the way to the east in effect today, all the way through about seven o'clock. And I bet we'll see this repeat into tomorrow as well. Southern Colorado, we do have some red flag warnings as well. So, just like we were talking about the wildfire uh, just before we started weather, you are going to want to really hold off on the burning today. But the forecasted highs, pretty warm 70s, 80s. And a few 90s, Roswell, 93, Carlsbad, 93 as well. Albuquerque will get to 82, and we'll see some of the cooler temperatures in southern Colorado. Durango will get to about 67 degrees, and Alamosa will get to 65 degrees for today. But overall, very warm and tracking some records. Yesterday, we did break some records in Roswell. We tied a record, but in Santa Fe and Tucumcari, we broke records by about 2 degrees. And you can see our highs today in comparison to the records falling just about a few degrees shy in most locations, but it is going to be warmer than normal. So today, the setup, a weak backdoor front is going to keep some areas to the east just a little bit cooler. But overall, warm will be the trend. Then tomorrow, winds pick up a little bit more. It's going to continue to stay hot. And we'll see our storm system starting to approach into California, and that's going to impact us into the weekend. But here's a look at some of those seven-day forecasts. Southern Colorado, 60s today. We'll get up to 70 degrees tomorrow with a chance for high mountain snow. Saturday and Sunday, some lower elevation rain with the 60s. As we get you into the northwest, 77 in Farmington with the upper 70s through Friday. Saturday, Sunday, we'll be back into the mid-70s with that storm system moving through into the southwest. A lot of 80s. TRC, 88 degrees. Almogorda, 86. And the 80s stick around through Saturday. We'll get a little bit cooler by Monday with the 60s returning. Into the south and east, we'll get to 90 degrees in Fort Sumner. Clovis will get to 86 degrees with the 90s through Roswell and Carlsbad. And holding on to the 90s all the way through Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, we could get some dry thunderstorms. Breezy, though, today, winds west 15 to 20 mi 25 miles an hour. Into the northeast, Raton 79, Springer 78 degrees. And we'll have the 60s, even 50s by Sunday and Monday with a storm system moving through. Windy today, west 20 to 30 mile an hour winds. Into the northern mountains, Chama will get to 68 degrees. 75 in Santa Fe in the mid 70s through the end of the week. A little bit cooler by early next week. Again, pairing with the passage of that next storm system into the East Mountains. Sunny and breezy today with the mid and upper 70s. And into the metro area, we're going to be seeing a lot of 80s. The foothills, though, up to 79. Sunny and warm. The heights will get to 81 degrees and 82 in Albuquerque. And more 80s tomorrow. We will cool off a little bit. And you can see I do have that icon Sunday for some dry thunderstorms moving through. That's the storm mm -hmm. system. It's going to help try and wipe out some of that pollen for us. So hopefully by early next week, not only cooler, but hopefully we'll be getting some relief with our allergies. Like that. Cassandra, thank you. Yeah.